Hey everybody, T.S. Madison is back in the States and back responding apparently to people still asking about her and Kaya and still defending herself uh, from Kaya's accusations of calling her a thief and saying that Madison was doing things behind her back that she didn't know about. So as you can see right here in Madison's IG post, basically, you know, sis is saying the truth will always come out. You know, Kaya painted her out to be a thief and to say that, you know, she went off on her own making decisions and she's just apparently defending herself once again. Um, let me start from the beginning. As you can see, somebody reached out eight weeks ago and said, hey, you all need to copyright the show. You know, you put a lot of work in. You don't want somebody to steal it from you. As you can see, Kaya responded, already done. We own it. Um, TS also posted an email where apparently they reached out to the owner of the queenscourt.com um, domain name in order to buy it. Obviously, the counter offer of eight twenty five was successful because we all know they went on to sell t shirts, etc., from that website. You can see um, a text message between the two of them, where Kai is like, "Hey, it's only going to grow bigger. We got to get traffic to the site. You know, did you speak to somebody about how to keep track of visitors per day, week, month, etc." You can see the response here. No, I'll email him. But to get constant traffic to the site, you know, we have to constantly say, you know, make sure you're going to the website, you know, the queenscourt.com. Uh, fast forward <laughs> to somebody saying, you know, that they felt like Monique tried to pull a stunt and that, you know, the ladies could have just stayed in the living room. Kaya responds, uh, you know, that. You know, she hadn't spent a dime and spent a dime for what? You know, she goes on to say she had been blogging from her couch and will continue to do so. You know, she goes on, you know, she referring to T.S. Madison. She can invite who she please. I just won't be involved, blah, blah, blah. You know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Um, You know, I, I will say this. I did see the first um gag order episode. You know, it just felt like one long rant to me, um, negative, um, not funny. You know, when I tune in to watch these ladies, you know, I'm tuning in to laugh, especially on a Monday, you know, I'm tuning in to laugh. And if you can't make me laugh, it's a good chance I won't be back. So I did not catch, um, her second episode of gag order. Really didn't hear a lot of people talking about it. So I kind of don't know one way or the other, you know, if she was still ranting or if maybe it had gotten a little funnier. Um, I will say this. I have been catching um, T.S. Madison. And when she was in Australia, I, I caught a couple of her videos and I will say she had me dying laughing. So if you didn't see her Australia like vlogs, please check them out. Here's a little clip. Y'all need to know that Monday, March 19th, see, I'm out of the country right now. And I know y'all been trying to trying to get me to respond to people making videos and stuff. I mean, bitch, I ain't doing all that. I don't do that. I don't do that. That ain't my sweat. That's the old T.S. Madison, bitch. That was a T.S. Bitch, I got too much money coming in right now. And, and that ain't bragging. It's just what it is. Bitch, I got too much money, too much business coming in. I can't be on back, going back and forth with a bitch online. Tell them. Like Bitch, I will be needing all team uh, T.S. Massa and the Maddie Mob. I will be needing y'all to tune in Monday, March 19th because the show is returning. And make sure that y'all see the promos. I will be will be dropping promos. There will be a little, uh, some more press coming out about the uh, press coming out about the, uh, the, the show and stuff like that, bitch. You're going to be, get, get ready. Get ready, she says. Get ready. Get ready. So, you know what? I'm I'm Team Maddie over here. I'm I'm waiting. I want to see what she comes with on March 19th. I'm excited. Um, she did at one point say, you know, hey, if Kaya kept kept talking trash, she was gonna take that eight o'clock time slot. Right now, she says it's gonna be ten, uh, ten ish, as you know they were originally. So 
I want to know in the comments who's watching on March 19th. I will be there. I'm waiting to see what she's bringing to the table. I'm waiting to laugh. I feel like I don't think I need to hear anybody else's side of the story. I want to be entertained at this point. So let me know in the comments. Are you tuning in on the 19th? And what are you expecting? Talk to you later.